Hey guys, Sterling here with the Motorcycle Travel Channel and I've got something really exciting to announce and share with you guys today. It's a new project that I've been working on and it's something that I'm going to share with you guys here on this channel very soon and I want to tell you all about it in this video. So it's the summer of 2020 and I just got back from an epic 6,000 mile 30 day solo ride across North America. And for those of you that know me, you know that for the last 10 years I've been producing the BDR Backcountry Discovery Route series of videos and this summer was a little unique because we didn't do a BDR project like we normally would because of the COVID-19 situation and the virus around the country. So I decided to ride around the backcountry of the United States and create the project that I'm telling you about now. I didn't have an itinerary, there was no schedule. I was free to just wake up and ride as far as I wanted or as little as I wanted any day, and that's what I did. I made the route up as I went along, I filmed everything along the way, and I just took my time and had the time to be able to do this kind of project that I've wanted to do for so long. This project was all about spending time by myself, riding on my motorcycle, camping, cooking, and just relaxing in the backcountry. I think when you spend time by yourself, and particularly in nature, um, it gives your soul a chance to quiet down and settle down and you begin to appreciate the world in a new way. You begin to appreciate nature and wildlife and solitude in a way that's invigorating. And it's a renewal of the spirit. You can go back to your everyday life refreshed and ready to contribute in a better way. So what are you going to see in this new series? I promise you're going to see some of the best roads in North America. I really did my best to get out in the backcountry and find these amazing, scenic, beautiful tarmac and unpaved roads, and I found a lot of them. You're gonna see some really beautiful campsites on this trip. My goal from the start was to camp every night on this trip and cook my own food, breakfast and dinner at the campsite. And that's exactly what I did. I spent so many nights in beautiful locations out in the desert, on mountaintops with just me and my motorcycle and my tent, and my hammock, cooking my own food, enjoying the beauty of nature around me, relaxing. And I think that's gonna come across really well in this series. And if you're interested in that kind of stuff, I think you'll, you'll really like this project. At different points along this series, I'll talk about some of the practical things like the bike that I'm riding, why I choose to ride that style of motorcycle and that bike in particular. I'll talk about the cameras and some of the filming that I did on this trip using my Fuji X-T3 mirrorless camera, my DJI drone and my GoPro action camera. I think I got some pretty awesome cinematography on this trip. It's some of the best footage that I've ever filmed. And particularly excited about sharing some of the drone footage that I got with you on this trip. I, I just, it takes my breath away every time I see those landscapes that I rode through. So the end result of this ride, 6,000 miles, 30 days, riding solo, the end result is that I've got over 20 brand new YouTube videos for this series. If you like the idea of riding solo in the back country of the American West, camping, cooking, relaxing, and just seeing some incredible scenic beauty. You're really gonna like this series, and I'm so happy to be able to share it with you guys.